Hey everyone, welcome to another one in Phasmophobia. We're gonna hop into Willow Street and as you can see we still got that Halloween update here because you see the spider webs over here. But yeah, by the time I'm recording this it's still Halloween. I love Halloween. The update was great. <laughs> okay, nice objectives. So let's try and figure out that ghost with zero evidence. Okay, so here we go. Let's hop right into yellow. Okay, so it's gonna be a bit dark because I don't have the headgear yet. But I hope it's okay. The breaker's not far away. Don't worry. There will be light soon. And maybe some ghost activity soon. Okay, let's see. Do we have a bony pants around here? Oh, my favorite hiding spot. Nice. That's good, that's good, I like that one. Nothing around here. Let's check here again. Oh, this one too? Perfect. Two good hiding spots, I love those too. Okay, let's see, nothing around here. Oh, please, Ghosty, don't be in the basement. Did I just hear something? Or was it again my footsteps? Ghosty, are you here? Oh, Bonnie Pants is here. Is that door open? Ghosty, are you here? Give us a sign. Oh, I don't see anything in here. <coughs> it might be in the basement. Let's uh, extinguish that candle so it won't run out. I'm gonna take care of the bone right now before I forget. Yes. Oh, that was the breaker. Okay, give me that interaction. Now the gin. That was early. That was some early kicking the power behavior. <laughs> okay, I haven't heard anything yet. Maybe it's in the basement. I'm gonna hate it. Okay, leave that here. Grab you. Let's go down there. I should have turned off the lights. Oh yeah, you are in there. I heard that. Are you in here? Oh my god, look at that mess. Okay, are you in here? Give me breath. It's either in here, yeah, there's the breath, or here, but it's there, okay. Oh my god, that's gonna be a tricky one. That's gonna be a tricky one for sure. Okay, let's turn that off, we don't need that anymore. And while we're here, why not, let's set up a bit for Polti. While we're on our way. Come on, pick it up. Sometimes it's so difficult to pick stuff up. Okay, how do we start? We start off with a crucifix, with a camera, and let's bring in salt for photos. Why not? Open this. So we can either hide there or there. I think I'm gonna use the living room here, because uh, the living room... I can see through the doors and look at the ghost. Okay, let's try and cover this room. Oh yeah, immediately stepped in it. <clears throat> okay, we need a camera. We need maybe another crucifix near the stairs so we can uh, ensure our escape route. Place those just in case. Okay, bring in one of those. Bring in this. Bring in this. This is uh, for Mimic and for UA. <coughs> We're gonna place it in the ghost room and let's see if it's gonna hunt me right now and I'm gonna die right away. <laughs> we'll see. It's 
still doing stuff even with the lights on, I think. <clears throat> okay, let's see. Don't see an Orby. Let's place this here and this one here. So we can keep an eye on that door. Let's hope it doesn't knock over the cam. Maybe I can place a backup cam in front of the door, outside of the ghost room. That might also work. Okay, what else? What else? It's so weird. This, the sound sensors, they sound so clear up here. That's actually weird. <laughs> okay, uh, let's set them up for the ghost highway now. Like this. And uh, let's place the other one here. <clears throat> okay, I'm gonna set up the hiding spot real quick. Okay, so we have set up some stuff upstairs. We're also gonna set up this here because I just wanna be sure that the ghost doesn't hunt here so I can escape upstairs because I think downstairs there's no hiding spot. <laughs> okay, let's bring in those buddies. So my sanity should still be fine. I was walking around in the light this whole time. Let's leave one here. We test for Benji like that. <clears throat> and well, I don't know, put another one here and another one here just for photos. Okay, where's the cruzy? Here. <clears throat> and let's put this here so we know if the ghost is roaming towards us. We will know. It's good that the ghost is in a room and not in the hallway because like that I can test for Benji easily. Okay, let's grab this. I'm gonna place this cam in front of the ghost room so in case that other one gets knocked over. We have a backup. Oh, we got a hiding spot here actually. Oh, that's, that's neat. That's good. Let's turn off the lights to get some more activity. And let's just sit here and see if it roams towards us, but I don't think that's gonna happen. But we'll see. We got a camera in case it's a phantom. So now we're just gonna test for Banshee. If it's a Banshee, it should be roaming towards my location. I hope this is not another bugged spot for the Banshee, because sometimes they are not able to have that path finding. I don't know why. Sometimes, for example, in Edgefield it doesn't work. I don't know why. Oh, you are doing some stuff in there. I need some photos. What? What, what, what? This? Hope it's right. Is it? Yes. Okay. Um, we got one, two, Three, um, four, is that right? Four. What the heck, where are you going? Five. Wait, was it actually roaming to my location here? Or was it just normal roaming? Wait, 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 that's a bit weird. I get distracted by the interactions. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Are you here right now? You've stepped into this here. You have to keep an eye on that sensor. Are you here? Have you gone back already? Oh my god, it's a Benji. You see that? It came back. Okay, give me the scream. That's not a scream. <laughs> At least I think it's a Benji. Let's keep an eye on that for a bit. But if it keeps doing that constantly, it may have just been roaming. I have to be careful not to trigger the sensor myself. <laughs> okay, that other sensor has been triggered. Will it come back here again? Come on, ghosty. It may have just been roaming, so we have to figure that out. Or it may be a phantom, that's also possible. For that we need a ghost event and to confirm it or a hunt. <laughs> Come on ghosty, do it again. 
I mean, a phantom is more likely to worm towards you when you're moving around. At least, I feel like that. That it's um. I'm not sure if it's a mechanic, but oh, I need this photo. I think it was that door, right? Was it? Yes. Let me cam. Please don't mess it up. Thank you. Okay, turn off the lights again for some activity. Okay, we got all the interaction photos now. Okay, so that's me now. Let's keep an eye on that sensor. Will you worm towards me once more? That was the other sensor. Come on, ghosty. Come on, just simply be a bench here. It would be totally fine. I have an EMF here, right? Yeah, here. Because, um... Last time when I was on Sunny Meadows... With a friend... Oh, now you're going crazy. What happened? Wait, wait, wait. It's going crazy? Did my sanity drop or something like that? Wait, I... I have to check because of the whispers. I was in the light the whole time. I have to check my sanity. If it's all of a sudden low as fuck, it might be a more way. Let me quickly check. Nah, that still looks fine. Oh god, we need a ghost picture. Are you kidding me? And firelight. Yeah, we can do that right now. Okay, let's hop back in. Okay, here we go. Wanna step into this? I'm here now. No? Okay. Here goes the I got something for you. You are right there. Okay, here. Have fun. <laughs> it's quite active even though my sanity is so high. But I think it was either a coincidence. Oh my god, you're going crazy in there. It was either a coincidence or it was a phantom. Let's see if it walks through here again but it seems like it's staying in its room for now so i don't i don't think it's a banshee oh my god this ghost is going crazy in there so it totally can do a ghost event in here by the way because this room is connected to the ghost room you only have three rooms down here. They are kind of all connected to each other or touching each other with the walls. So a ghost can do a ghost event no matter where you are here in the basement, if the ghost is in the basement. Oh my god, you're going crazy. It has blown out the firelight. Great. What the heck is going on? Can you please give me a ghost event? It's going crazy in there. Okay, it doesn't seem like it's coming towards me again, so maybe it was just a coincidence. God damn it. Oh my god. Oh! Ah! No! Ah, okay. I was about to say, did you kill the breaker or what? No, it was an airball, so not an Oni. Thank you for letting me know, Ghosty. Appreciate that. I don't have to watch out for that anymore. I mean, it's for sure not a shade. My sanity is so damn high, it can't be a shade. We are at about 90%, more than 95, so I don't think it's a shade then. And it's so active. Maybe a they? So not an only since we got the airball event. But yeah, now we have... to drain our sanity a bit and let's see how much sanity that airball drained okay that's a normal amount and yeah but we need the picture of the ghost still oh, this is gonna be so difficult okay i'm not gonna drain my sanity yet i'm gonna wait for a ghost event so i'll be back oh my god guys you see that it knocked over that cam just as i thought <laughs> so that's why i got my backup cam here I don't think it's able to knock it over now. 
But you see that it keeps throwing stuff in here non-stop. And no reaction to the light switches yet. Uh, you see that it immediately throws something again. Show us, give us a sign. Where are you? Show yourself. Are you here? Show yourself. Are you here? Show yourself. <laughs> so weird. Okay, I'm gonna wait for the event. Oh, wait a second. I left the lights off, right? Ghosty, you've turned on the light. Thank you. You're not a mayor then. Oh, hey there. <laughs> he was right in front of me. <laughs> you can also take a picture of the door if that happens. Okay, uh, that means it has drained my sanity. Great. <laughs> That's what I wanted. Did it count? Please tell me it counts. Yes. <laughs> okay. We got the ghost picture. Well, <laughs> that, that was a close one. So I think uh, I was at 78 before. So I think my sanity... I wanted to grab my cam initially. And then I just saw... Oh, wait, the light's on. I didn't do that. So yeah, we can rule out Mare. Hey, nice. We got the ghost picture. Yeah. <laughs> and we have lost sanity because uh, somehow I have despawned the ghost. Because it was right in front of me that was the ghost event yeah perfect so now we have to wait a bit more let's see if it starts hunting now because if it tries to hunt now then it's uh, probably uh, right you and if we have to wait for a bit then it's not an early hunting ghost i think so we'll see um we could also test for on rio down there you know what i'm gonna bring in the candles right now so i got them there because there's a hiding spot right next to the ghost room so i can just uh, have a candle there and a candle inside the ghost room and just test if it's hunting if it tries to hunt when there's a lit candle nearby so yeah i'll be back okay here we are so we're just gonna sit here with that candle because I don't have the tier 3 lighter. But we're gonna do that test later. Hey buddy, thank you for the nice picture. <laughs> um, I don't thank you for that. That was not the crucifix, it was just the waker being turned off. <laughs> you see the tier 3 flashlights, it looks like uh, the building's lights. They are so bright. I always place them so I can find a way or I can see the ghost even if the boy is off because they love to turn it off before they start hunting. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna drain our sanity here. I'll be back. Okay, <clears throat> it hasn't tried to hunt yet and we are below 50%. We could have a day open here, which would be nice, but <laughs> I would have to turn on some lights somewhere because of that but we'll see we can we can grab this flashlight and we can run into the garage i could go down there right now and remove the crucifix because we don't need it you know what i'm actually gonna do that i might die here so we are above 50 percent damn it it just killed the breaker, goddammit. That was not the crucifix, it was the breaker. But I need the breaker. Fortunately, you can turn on the breaker during a hunt. That's good. <laughs> Door still open. <clears throat> yeah, that was the breaker. I just wanted to remove the crucifix so you can hunt. My guy, please, be nice. I just want to allow you to hunt. Aren't you happy about that? Come on. Don't be so angry. So, look, Ghosty. I'm just gonna do this, okay? I'm gonna place this here. Just to secure the hiding spot, but not your room. Here you go. Action, Ghosty. Let's go. <laughs> I hope uh, it won't use the crucifix there. <laughs> if it's lying next to it, I might have to use it later for um on rio test but yeah it hasn't tried to hunt a single time now oh here we go yeah it's a deal you hear that 
You hear that? It's gonna come to us right away. Listen. Hey, buddy! <laughs> oh, I love these girls. I love the open. I don't have a light with me now, but I hope that's gonna be fine. Nice walk with the open. Oh, I love these ghosts. I love them. If you know you're dealing with the open, or you might be dealing with the open, it's totally fine. They are great. I love those. So, sorry guys, I have to go for another walk with it. I have to. There's, there's no other way. If I'm dealing with a weapon and I have to play with it, and if I'm dealing with a Deokan, not only one walk, we're gonna have two walks. Listen, a train in Willow. Get over here. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Come on, let's have a nice walk through the house. Come on, let's go. Come on, get over here. Oh, that's so great. I love those girls. Meow. Look at the kettle fly. Oh, I wanted to go to the garage with you. Okay, we were at the garage. So we had two nice walks with that ghost. He was so nice. We could have taken the photo during that hunt, of course, but we didn't know at that point if it's a day open. So the open hunts at 40% sanity. That's how you can know before the hunt even starts that you might be dealing with a Deokhan and because it tried to hunt that late, I was like, yeah, we might be dealing with Deokhan. That's why I've removed that crucifix so it can hunt as soon as I hit 40% and as you can see we are now at 35, 39 roundabout. So yeah, if you see a ghost that hunts late, so not at 50%, if you're at, if you're at 50% and it's not hunting at all, you might be dealing with a shade or the open, but for a shade it was way too active. The ghost event happened way too early, so the open it could have also been like a lazy yokai, a, a lazy uh, poltergeist that just hunts late. It could happen too, but if you see it starts hunting at about 40% sanity, keep in mind that you might be dealing with a the open, so try to have a looping spot nearby and a hiding spot in case if it's not a the open. So be prepared for both. Oh, I love this ghost type, I love it. <laughs> that was so great. <laughs> a nice run on Willow. And maybe I can unlock some new gear finally. Should be a perfect game? Welcome yes, back. it is. I've got some jobs ready for you. Oh yeah, give me that money and we get some dailies, right? Yeah, we get some dailies done too. So yeah, that's the amount of money you get with zero evidence and if you turn off the squint and stuff. You can also see my settings in the description if you want to play it for yourself. I love this way to play. It's not cheesy. It's still fun to play that way. And you still have some interaction with the ghost. You still have to figure it out. You don't just numbly uh, make it hunt and try to figure it only out doing the hunt. Yes, I sometimes play on this setting with zero sanity. Sometimes. But not every time. I just let my sanity drop naturally and uh, first uh, rule out the ghost you can't rule out doing a hunt and then when the sanity is low enough, well, I'm testing the hunting ghosts. It's the way I proceed. So if you want to try it out for yourself, go ahead. It's I think it's fun. You can also um, increase the sanity drain rate, of course. So your sanity drains faster because there's no cursed possession because I don't need this. I need all my sanity to figure out uh, the ghost uh, the ghost that you can only figure out outside of a hunt beforehand. So for example it killed the waker I knew okay it's not a gin it turned on the light. Sometimes the ghost needs some time to show all this stuff and I think it's easier to figure them out that way. Of course you need some patience but yeah that was a nice day open. I haven't unlocked anything new, unfortunately. So yeah, <laughs> see you in the next one. Bye.